Hong Kong. I finally made it. So it was through room tour. So, oh my God, look. So here's a fold length mirror. I haven't had one all of Asia. Gained a couple of counts from speaking Asia. So this is when you enter. And then here we have, you know, the normal closet situation. We're still waiting for our luggages because they're bringing it up for us. The service here is impeccable. So this is the TV. Then we have this. So this is actually like a really big space. And then I have two queen beds over here. And this is our view of Hong Kong. So we are on the top floor. This is our view from the Hong Kong Hotel. Okay, I saved the best for last because the bathroom oh, it's amazing. So that's the mirror. And then we have like a nice sink and I love how long it is. And then we have a toilet and we have a bathtub and we have a shower. So this hotel was actually recently renovated after COVID. So everything here is like it's like less than a year old new. I had to wait to reserve this room. But you know what I Loving it. All right, now I'm gonna get dressed. I actually got an allergic reaction from my eyelashes when I was in China. So, for, and like, it was like. I just had to do one more day and I was leaving China to come to Hong Kong and I do trust Hong Kong a little bit more so I found like a place where they do like eyelash extensions and I kind of like, got it removed so yeah I got like an allergic reaction all over my eyelids so it was like best to just remove it all together and I removed it and how much does it cost? And it'll cost like $19 so pretty good and no tip so I actually went to this K11 mall to swap lash. We're at Australian Dairy Queen. We're at the Hong Kong airport and we're going to Macau. Just left Hong Kong. Now we're going to Macau for a day and a night and this is the airport. I remember this place. I was here five years ago. Here at the Londoner in Macau. We're still waiting for two of my cousins. Um, so we're just gonna be walking around. We're a bit earlier. I look so naked without my lashes, but I got it removed and it feels so good. Although. I'm freaking out. It's so hot. It is like 90 degrees and I'm wearing like pants. I have my luggage with me because we're staying in Macau for one night. We're staying at Conrad but we're waiting for my cousins and look there's the Eiffel Tower and then there's like London and Country. If only traveling was this easy. London on one side and Paris on the other but I would say this is like Vegas, but much grander. I came here five years ago, but we're not really gonna be staying around the main strip. I wanna walk around the areas and eat some good food because they have really good street food here. And welcome to Macau. We're counting coins because there's so many. Of like, there's Hong Kong, Macau dollars, we have, we have Thailand coins too. Hello from the ruins of St. Paul's. We're just going to be walking on the streets and eating, but we came here last time at night. Streets of Macau. 
Hello, reporting again from Street of Macau. I took a public bus to get here because we couldn't call a car, a cab. But we have so much stuff. Like, look at this. Funny like that too. So it's actually very heavy. And I didn't realize that my cousin told me that Macau has a donkey. So it's like the Japanese, like right there. <laughs> right there. You best believe I'm gonna have a lot to buy. We're eating food. Hello. All right. So we made it to Conrad. We finally checked in. It's pretty late. It's 7 p.m. We got so many like souvenirs and stuff, and then we also found like a bunch of snacks, a bag full of snacks to bring back to America. So. I checked in, so let's do a room tour. This is the entryway. I love how they have a table right here. And then we have like closets. Ooh. You have a hair dryer. We got some shoe horns. Wow, pretty nice. And then we have some robes. And then we have a full length mirror. That's my mommy. And then we have like a coffee station. Oh, there's jasmine tea. Yo, I'm taking these. All right, can I pee? Um, no. Here's this. And then we got two queen beds. And then we have this thing with the TV. And then we have another long table right here. And then we have a whole couch. And the cutest is each bed has like its own little bear. It's so cute, I'm taking you. But it does say take me home and then I want to save the best for last. This is the bathroom Wow. And then we have a whole little oh my god the bathtub has a mirror yeah. and look there's a ducky And then we have two sinks. Oh my god. I love the dual sinks. Oh my god. And then we have a bathroom Wow, and then we have a huge shower. All right, so now we're just going to, we're going to relax a little bit, and then we're probably gonna go get some dinner and explore a little bit more, but that's the hotel. This is my view, Eiffel Tower views. Okay, we, did, we walked around some shops, then we tried some Portuguese egg tarts from this famous place, it's called Lord Stowe's Bakery and we walked all around just to find a Christmas tree. The holiday season is approaching us and we finally found it. <laughs> it's so pretty. Hello, we are back in Hong Kong and we're gonna do some touristy things today. So here's a comfy outfit of the day with jeans, this, this. And sissy and mommy are in the front. I'm out of breath because I just climbed some stairs because we're gonna go to Victoria's Peak today and hopefully find a train to go up. I haven't been here in very long time. Last time I came in was 2018. So two, no, yeah, it was almost like five years ago. We made it. Five 
It's not Christmas yet, but they're getting ready for Christmas! Oh, the view here is so nice, but it's really windy up here. I'm hoping my buffler works. Oh, we finally reached like sunset time, almost. But here's the sunset. <gasps> it's already. But it's so windy and like I'm freezing. <gasps> Look how beautiful it is. It's so cold, so I'm gonna stick with a thicker jacket today because we're gonna go see the waterfront at night. We're by the waterfront because we just finished dinner, so I'm like really full. I feel like I'm just constantly stuffing myself on the trip. But it's okay because I will lose it all back. So right now we're just chilling. We're walking the bridge um, to get to the other side. And then we're just gonna, the three of us are just going to walk the bridge and see the water and just see like Hong Kong nightlife. Okay guys, I found something that is so me, a Christmas, a, a luxury Christmas tree. Like, look at this. It's a Dior Christmas tree. Oh my God. Look at that. Would you just look at this beauty? Second to last day. So we have one more full day tomorrow and then we're leaving. Wow, this two weeks is coming to an end pretty quick. So we, Woke up a little bit late. We wanted a late start to the morning. It is almost 11 right now. We're gonna go get breakfast now, more like brunch. And then I think. And then right now we're getting breakfast. It's called Gamwa. So it's like I really want this pineapple bun. It's like really famous there. So we're gonna go get breakfast. And we're just gonna. Today's plan is just walking around and just shopping here and there. There's a street in Hong Kong that's called Women's Street. And it's just like buying all these like little accessories here and there. So we're gonna walk there and then just bring you along. Yeah, yeah, straight. It's that one that I want. Oh, my photo, yo. You eat home, We made it to ladies market and it's so hot. The sun is like beaming. So this is what it is. It is just like stalls and stalls of like, you know, like scarves, keychain, just like little cutesy stuff. It's like, it goes on and on and on, but it looks, it looks like there's not many people here yet. Cause I think they're just opening the stall, but like at night it gets really busy. So. Oh, what's this? The children's camera. All right, some Saint Laurent. This is ladies' market. We are at the other end of the pier. And there is the clock tower. It's the same pier, but. I wanted to go to this section. Ooh, pretty. I literally have a triangle right here. I went to get breakfast. Mm. I just went to like a random cafe to get breakfast because nobody else wanted breakfast and everyone's so full. So I got a bolo bao. Got a pineapple bolo pao. So get a bowl of bao, so pineapple bun from Red Tea Cafe. This one's from my mom. And then I got something that I've been wanting for so long. So it's toast with condensed milk from Hong Kong. Uh, every time I go anywhere, anytime I go to like a Hong Kong cafe in New York, I always have to get this. I only got it once when I was in China. It's so little. I need like slather with. Mmm. Oh yeah. That's good. I'm gonna get ready because we're going to Disneyland today. Oh my god, look at all my pimples. It is 
Please ignore him. And my hair is a mess. I need to do it. I need to put on some more makeup. My third Disney of the world. Oh my god, look, the Christmas tree is up. <laughs> Welcome to Main Street. Alright, let's figure out what we're gonna do. First, we're gonna go to the Iron Man experience. The Stark Expo. Oh, shield. Come to the Stark Expo with me. Oh my god, I love Disney because their meals are Chinese food! We're at it, the small world! It's a small world! It's a small world! We did it! We did it! We did it! We got it! We got it! Hello. So I am in Hong Kong Disneyland, the world of Frozen. And so it's not open to the public. You need like special entry and you need like a wristband and this. And I I I wanted to come here so bad and I'm finally here and I'm just so thankful that I'm allowed to be here. But I made it. Alright, but then I bought like a whole bag of stuff. Because I went through a lot to be here. And my sister went on a roller coaster, but you know, I don't go on roller coasters, so she's gonna have fun. I mean I want to because it's frozen, but I don't wanna go on one. Alright, I'm just gonna walk around. <laughs> Hello and good morning from the airport. It's bittersweet. Um, we're 17 days here in Asia, and luckily we had some relatives help us bring because we have seven luggages between three people. Thank you so much, Asia. And I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. I don't know how crazy it is. It's either going to be separate into like multiple vlogs or just one. Mm -hmm. 